Hi Tooligans, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all doing well. Firstly, let me say hello and thanks to any new and um, all my existing subscribers. If you enjoyed the video, guys, if you hit that subscribe button, that'd be much appreciated. I haven't looked through my analytics and about 80% of people haven't subscribed to the channel. That'd be massive to the channel if you could all subscribe. So thanks if you do and in advance, thank you. Today, I'm going to be going over the little Nipex pouch I've set up. It's EDC, so everyday carry. I just chucked a few things in there I think would be handy for myself to use and work. Um, I've got a couple of other tools to show you if you want to mix it up a little bit. So I'll bring it a bit closer and we'll go over the little Nipex pouch. So then guys, this is my little Nipex setup um, for my EDC everyday carry. The pouch is from Nipex. You've got a little belt hook there. As you can see when it's in, it locks in place. You could also slide your belt behind, go through there. Uh, this is really nice because obviously on the side of your hip, it's going to keep it compressed and keep that catch on. Um, you've got a Velcro lid on it. Just keep everything in nice and secure. You've got a nice bottom out pouch. Also, I don't know if it's very wise of me. I made a little hole on the side here um, I just heated up an old screwdriver, pushed it through, and I've just popped one of these um, bit holders on the side. Uh, don't know, I think it m might be a good idea, might be a bad idea. I'll see in a couple of months, see how it's holding up. So, in the Nipex pouch, firstly, I've got my Nipex cab key on the side with the interchangeable bits. These bits stay in really well. Um, I was wasn't sure whether or not to keep them on the side, whether they would stay um, in the holder, but they do. Otherwise, what I was going to do, in the lid here, you've got this little strip in there. I was going to pop them in, because when it's brought over, it, they hold in there. So I've popped the cab key in there. And I've got multiple tools on there that I can use to open any cabs, any control units any panels and then I've got the TX I think that's the 20 and 25 and I've got a Phillips and a flat there on this side I've got my little trusty Unilite IL175R rechargeable light done a review on this earlier handy little thing and great for what I need it for. So is that as well. Inside the pouch, I've got a tracer pen. Pop any pen in there, pen or pencil. I pop the tracer in there. And then one of my favorite tools at the moment are these little Nipex plier wrenches. Really nice bit of kit, really handy. Um, this is my first set I've bought. Wish I bought them sooner. Very nice. So they also go in there. Then I've got a pair of 160 side cutters in there. You can actually fit 180s. I put my 180s in here and this lid comes over. You've got enough space. I've got my Nipex 160 side cutters in there as well. Just for size wise in the pouch, you can fit your scissors in there, your electrician shears, you can mix it up, you could prop your Cobras in there. So you could have your plier wrench and your Cobras. Just squeeze past that pocket. Because on the inside, you've got this double pocket attachment. You could pop other pliers in there. You could put the engineer pliers in there. You can mix it up how you want it. I might put the little ratchet in there. This is only a cheapy little thing. Um, but you could drop that down the sides. You could put some small cobras in there, some really small cobras. You know, and with these elasticated sides, you can fit bits down the side. I don't know, if you want to, you could pop a little screwdriver down the side. Holds in there. You've got a height, it's not going to go nowhere. I don't know, do you want to pop a wearer down the side as well, spanner? 
it's totally up to you. That's the good thing with the EDCs, um, everyday carry. You mix it up how you want it and for your best needs. So I've got a setup now. No doubt it's going to change shortly. Um, I think I'm going to get a smaller set of these or maybe the ones without the VD handles because they are quite um, cumbersome there on the edge, maybe just get the dipped coated ones like the pliers wrench, maybe get them instead. Um, but the 180s, like I said, they, they fit in there. You can see you've got a bit of play and with all is you just have the um, top a bit, a bit higher. Pop them back in. Them in there. Oops. And pop the uni light back on. There you go, that's just my little EDC, everyday carry setup. Like I said, totally personalise it to yourself. Um, I'll let you know about that, how that handles up. It's not going to be pulled on as such, it's just more there um, to add bits to it. For the screwdriver, so if I ever want to take them out, I just put a bit hold on the side. You can get the long ones, um, you just pop the bits down. And you can change your power if you want it. Let me know what you're using, guys. What pouch size you're using, um, and what bits you got in yours. Let me know in the comments if you change any of this or what you think about it. Thanks for your time, guys. Just a small video. If you'd like the video, please subscribe to the channel. It goes a long way to help the channel grow. Thank you for your time, guys. Hope you enjoy the video.